Okay, Virgo, what's up, Virgo, Earth Signs? So this is gonna be a reading for 2020, January. Please keep in mind, this is general. It's not gonna resonate with everyone. I will be looking at you and your obstacles, your situation, past, present, future. I'm going to be looking into that and the outcome as well as your partner. And if, you know, you don't have a partner, this is someone, this could be, you know, your inner work, your inner guide, your higher self. You can relate it to anybody as well. If it, this side doesn't resonate with you, Virgo, because this is the side I use as Virgo, and this is your person, you can vice versa. If you're a cross watcher, welcome. Okay, let's see what's happening. Let's see what's happening with Virgo. Sun, Moon, Rising, Venus. If you don't know that, please go ahead and check. Uh, in my description box, I have a link to astro.com. I really do enjoy them. I like them. I like their natal charts and um, how they... Uh, bring it about if you don't like that there's um cafe astrology you guys you can go to that as well and see your sun moon rising venus okay spirit guides guardian angels or if you're dealing with the sun moon rising venus virgo as well what is the message for virgo energy spirit guides guardian angels and they're telling me to cut it okay an extended reading okay are interested in one go ahead and shoot me an email and say hey I would like one but I'm not doing them right now okay I just want to see how many people would be interested in it before I open up an account so this is you Virgo this is your person and this is your uh, current position and your obstacles this is your aspiration goals what needs to be awakened what needs to be awakened in them this is what sits behind them as well what sits behind you okay this is you're the next stage this is their next stage their next move towards you this is what will be of the relationship itself okay um and this is the nine of swords on the bottom of the deck and it is in reverse okay Somebody's riding around on the four wheeler. Okay, so the nine of swords is in reverse. Coming out of this grief, coming out of this sorrow, coming out of this inspiration, okay? So we have the four of swords. This is, um, the four of swords represents, um, you know, this Virgo energy, you could be relating to Leo as well, okay? So you might want to watch the Leo energy. So, okay, Virgo, you are going within okay and th thinking about an offer that somebody has pop possibly made to you and i definitely feel like this person your person has definitely made an offer to you they they made a decision look it's like this person has definitely made a decision they could be an air sign looking towards you okay virgo wanting to take action they see you as someone who is very passionate very loving very caring someone who is very beautiful very like a social butterfly sagittarius leo aries they think that you are very uh um, spontaneous, you know, adventurous, um, very intriguing, uh, flattering, okay? Um, so they, they, they really want to take action with you, but it's like this person also, also, I feel like this person could be dealing with someone else as well, and they need to let loose. They need to release this person, okay, before they move in with you because this is what's crossing them, okay? And this is who you are dealing with, Libra, Gemini, Aquarius, okay? So it's like, Virgo, this is definitely something that, and I want to say, yeah, Virgo, it's like, you know, should I take action? Shouldn't I? Should I take action? Shouldn't I? You know, it's like an up and down um, situation with this person. Um, but this is this person is I feel like it's coming out of fear for some uh, coming out of their fear or coming out of this, you know, up and down motion. OK, I, I also feel OK with the seven of coins here. This is um, setting the intention, planning and not only planning this is setting intention and giving it nutrients giving it growing it this is you know wanting to make things work i feel like you are wanting to make things work with this individual okay but this individual has a situation who he needs to, or they need to let go of possibly they could be with someone else okay and i feel like you have made an offer virgo to this individual uh, as well okay there is a third party situation as well right here with the three of swords as you can see someone will get hurt as well well what needs to be awakened within you is this three of cups energy you know this is like realizing that this person has um 
has this you guys need to talk you need to communicate okay you need to communicate you need to find out what's really going on uh, I mean or maybe you guys have talked about it already but there is a sense that you know again we have three 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 you know this is a strong indication that there is another woman involved here and not only are they involved here but it's like you know maybe it is that you're going through a divorce okay and they this person um, or they're going through a divorce whatever you could have been going through a divorce with them okay because they have cheated on you as well okay Virgo now what is going to be awakened so we have temperance here temperance here is like take things slowly don't rush don't rush right on into everything because you know why because the Sun card is definitely coming through here um, you things are going to work out as planned okay now whether this person is going through a divorce or whatever kind of situation uh, and I do I feel like in the past you went through a divorce okay and they were like, okay, I can't do this right now. You know, this is, I have to go within. I have to use my intuition, okay? Um, I, you know, this person could have blocked you as well. Um, and this person definitely had a lot of pain, a lot of sorrow. But not only that, I feel like they think about you all the time. And they want to reconciliate with you. You are going through some sort of, um, you know, a breakup, okay? Whether it was this person or somebody else, okay? There's quite a Sagittarius here, but this card of Sagittarius, we have Libra energy showing right here, very strong. Um, and uh, Sagittarius, Leo, um, Libra, but this energy of taking things slowly, temperance, this is guide. Um, universe coming in major arcanas you know seeing things in a bigger perspective taking things slowly not rushing in you know giving it time as well because you know this energy is unknown this energy is using your intuition to the most highest you know this energy what will it be well we have the moon card here we have a sense of vision you know what you want but how do you get it it's that walk in that moonlight you know so you really have to have some courage and you really have to have some strength that you can build up within yourself and that's what moderation is saying take things slowly because look this person is bringing in the sun and this is like a yin and yang energy coming in okay fear is being released here from you Virgo I, I, I do I feel like it's being released and as it's being released you're gaining more insight and clarity on what it is that you need to do and how to move on okay and um, we have at day's end rest so this is basically telling you to rest rest your mind or rest your intuition you're using your your intuition as well I'm seeing that um, you could be dealing with an air sign yeah most definitely it says I find peace in nature and that reminds me of like oh gosh that reminds me of like a marijuana leaf or something yeah so it's like you know maybe you guys need to um, smoke a joint or something oh wow okay don't hate me for it, you know. Um, let's see. I find peace in nature and rest my body and mind in order to connect to spirit. For some of you, that's what it is. For others of you, it's not, okay? And you don't have to do that, you know. It, everybody has a choice and whatever you like is up to you. But anyways, this it's saying find stability within the, within the ends of the day, you know, after all this... Um, all these troubles that you've been going through you know yes you've got a lot done yes you, you need to take things slowly yes there is another person here that is involved with you okay and not knowing what's gonna happen or where it's going to go there is this person is definitely helping you see the light at the end of the tunnel just take things slowly don't rush into it okay because you just went through something that was traumatic within your life that has ended okay so if this resonates with you, Virgo, please like, share, and give it a thumbs up. And now, like I said, if you when I do an extended reading, I will be looking more into this person, these people, you know, these significators here. We have air signs, Sagittarius, Virgo, um, Sagittarius, uh, Sagittarius, Leo, Aries. Aries we have um, Aquarius Gemini Libra we also have a Leo energy here Sagittarius here um, and I will be looking into you know how they feel about you their true intentions you know basically all that I use many different cards as well so if you would like an extended reading I don't do them now I will be doing that in the future just shoot me an email it doesn't have to say anything maybe a heart or whatever okay thank you so much